Thank you for joining today's Words of Wisdom with Prayers. Are there are many people who are worried and suffering because they do not know which of the information tra traveling around, around the world is truth. May these people encounter Lord El Cantare. Listen and read the words of the Lord and grasp the truth. And may they be able to overcome their worries and suffering. Today's words of wisdom is make your mind as clear as a mirror. Clean off your bad thoughts. Have you all got your copy of the laws of hell yet? Please defin definitely get it. In order to give you a deeper and broader understanding of the laws of hell, I have previously introduced the teachings on hell, such as it is 100% true that hell exists, aspects of hell, hell, a world more than 50% of people fall into. People fall into hell. Causes of falling into hell. What and how to reflect on what we should do to avoid falling to hell. Remove the cause and return to heaven. I would like to provide these kinds of teachings over and over again so that you and those around you can avoid falling into hell. And if you do fall, return to heaven. And today, we will learn about how to prevent yourself from falling into hell from the most important curtain of the, the year, the laws of hell. Page 161 to 164. You will know which hell you will go to by simply reflecting on your life. You do not need to ask a psychic or a spiritual expert to know where you will go after death. You will know it just by examining the life you are living. What kind of thoughts do you have? If you are living that kind of life, that would burn others to death with your flames of jealousy. You will go to the hell of scorching heat. If you are involved with violence and bloodshed, you will mostly likely go to a place called the Ashura Hell or the Hell of Villains. If you are living a corrupt life driven by lust, in most cases you'll be dragged over to the hell of the bloody pond or somewhere near there. Some people advocate 
the wrong philosophies and make many people unhappy. Those with wrong political thoughts, especially found among leftists, those with wrong religious thoughts, and those who have influenced many people with wrong fundamental ideas and led them astray will all go to a deep, deep place called Abishra, Abishmal, Abishmal hell. It is like the pit of well, and they cannot get out of it. This is where they will fall into. So there is no need to ask, which hell will I go to? Reflect on your life, and you shall know it. Make an effort to turn your mind into a mirror and wipe off bad thoughts. Diseases such as rheumatism may have a worldly cause, but viewed spiritually, people with rheumatism are in many cases possessed by various spirits such as snake spirits. The same can be said about shoulder problems, including stiff or frozen shoulders, and about elements such as not being able to stand up because of a bent back or weak legs. Of course, there can be some physical cause but if you are sick all the time without any particular reason, it is possible that you are being possessed by animal spirits and the like. At these times, please make an effort to purify your mind and make it as clear as a mirror. Just like wiping a mirror with a cloth, clean off your bad thought. When your room is dirty and messy, other people will not come and clean it up for you. In fact, you probably will not allow them to enter your room and clean it without asking, just because they want to. If you have made your room messy, dirty, and full of trash, it is your job to clean it up. If you want to study further, please read that chapter 3, Kasi's spells, and positions. In the description section of this YouTube, YouTube video, you will find the link for the Kyoten The Laws of Hell. If you have not yet obtained a your copy, please access and get the one. Also, please share this link with those around you. Now, let us decide our business players. Lord El Cantare, Master Ryuho Oka. Thank you very much for giving us your great light every day. 
we practice the principles of happiness, love, wisdom, self-reflection, and progress to make the world better with our brothers and sisters. Without gratitude, we recite the true words spoken by Buddha, prayer to the Lord, and prayer to guardian and guiding spirits. The true words spoken by Buddha, Ryoho Oka. There used to be the light in the great universe. The light is the energy of Buddha. People can live by this energy. And Buddha's energy has made human history. It will be supplied eternally. This eternal light comes from heaven and prevails on earth. This is the light of heaven. Through the prism of Buddha, there appear the seven colors of rainbow arching over in the sky. Here you can see Buddha's mercy. Yellow is the color of teaching. White is the color of saving. Red is the color of justice. Purple is the color of obedience. Blue is the color of thinking. Green is the color of harmony. Silver is the color of progress. These seven colors help each other, and there appears Buddha land. Buddha land is shining brightly because of gathering of bodhisattvas. This is the land of love or the land of mercy. This is the land of wisdom or the land of teaching. Especially, this is the land of souls, rest in peace. Real souls are the children of Buddha. The children of Buddha became real human beings. Real human beings have spirituality. The spirits are immortal powers. The spirits are immortal forces. The spirits are real entities. The physical bodies are the shadows of the spirits. It means you are the boat sailing down the great river. The great river is a symbol of the course of lives. Each of you sails down as a small boat, so you need a boatman. If it were not for your own boatman, you surely go aground. This boatman really means your mind. If your mind makes a mistake, the boat breaks into pieces by a large rock. And you also need a bamboo pole. This pole is the meaning of the true words. When you go down a rapid stream, you need to pan in a stream. Then you can change your course. The true words means the teaching of Buddha. Buddha enlightened and spoke the true words. And Buddha's teaching became a golden mind. This golden mind suggests various teachings. These are another expression of Buddha's truth. It brightens up your days. Or, to put it another way, the fruits of Buddha's mercy. All of you, now, here. Listen to me. Never lose your way, now and forever. The guiding hand has already waved. Please follow this white hand and go straightly on and on. Your lives are not limited to this world only. They have three aspects. The past, the present, the future. Your past have already gone by. Yet still, your mistakes will be kept in your mind. That is the reason why you should understand other people, and you yourself should reflect on what you have done. You and others are not different. On the contrary, both are children of Buddha and brothers and sisters. Now then, love each other. Let us bring up each other, and it's time to forgive each other. This is the eternal law, which penetrates the present and the future. Yes, indeed, the light of the dark night, the dark night of this world is hell. It is also the same in another world. Since we came down to this world, the sun of the truth is scheduled to rise. Now we are watching rising sun. It will shed light to the future to invite sad people to Buddha land. Now, here I command, 
There shall not be conflict in this world. There shall not be distrust in this world. There shall not be crime in this world. There shall not be evil spirits in this world. There shall not be the devil in the next world. Only the ideal world, utopia, shall be realized. All of the people love each other, live harmoniously, believe in one another. The world is utopia. All of us could be the light of bodhisattvas, believing that the light has reality, believing that love has reality, believing that the truth has reality. These are the facts that should be conveyed. We, the light of bodhisattvas, get together, work together to keep light nine and live in tune with Buddha's words. Here we vow to do so. Prayer to the Lord. Our Lord El Cantare, you are the source of all light, all power, all wisdom, and all love. May you give us light, give us power, give us wisdom, and give us love. O oh Lord, our Father, please protect this planet of love, Earth. Protect us from all evil and open a future for us. Our Lord, thank you for giving us light. We give thanks from the bottom of our hearts. Prayer to Guardian and Guiding Spirits My Guardian and Guiding Spirits, Deep inside of me, you are the fountain of life, the light of hope, the source of wisdom, and the seed of courage. Every day, may you help me develop my soul and define my mind. Every day, may you give me inspiration and show me the right path to follow. Please protect me from all evil and guide me in living a better life. For this, I give my thanks. Thank you for joining. Have a wonderful day.